God has put me in this position. And that's who you're going to have to take it up with. You're going to have to pray. Wait until the last minute. Someone say, hey, baby, I want to come over. Whatever. <laughs> and I wish a bitch for a bigger wood. Oh, crap. Stay your tax bracket, Pooh. Stay in your lane. I know it's lame or whatever, but just stay there. Okay? Or just wherever you follow me, it's nothing but confidence. It's nothing but growth. It's nothing but winning. No, don't come to me telling me no negative stuff that somebody done told you about me that don't like me. I don't want to hear that. Barbie and I'm back with another video. If you're a time subscriber, hey, if you're new here, do not forget to subscribe and join the bougie crew because it's a bougie way and I wait. Period. Period. Okay, period. So today I'm just like running some errands. So this is gonna be like a vlog with me. This is another Friday vlog. So um I'm doing a promo today. And um, what else am I doing? I'm basically off today. I'm about to ship off two orders. Um, wholesale order and a starter kit, and then I'm gonna get my car wash. Oh, it's Valentine's Day, so I'm gonna pick up my my mom got me some strawberry, some chocolate strawberries, and some chocolate white chocolate pineapples made. So I'm gonna pick those up, and also I'm going to be going to the mall. So we'll just see, cause I'm 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 gonna be doing some stuff. But I don't know, like, if I'm going to do it in that order. And I don't know if I'm going to do so. Like, I don't know. So, we'll just see. You know, we're just going to go with the flow. Okay? So, we're about to go down to the car. And I know where I parked at this time. I parked on floor one. But, yeah. So, let's go. So, what are y'all doing? So, um... I'm best to get my car washed first because I don't know how long that's gonna take. I need my car washed because I got like bird poop on my car. And if you don't get that washed off immediately, then it does something to your paint. So, um, and I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that. This is my baby. This is, I love my car. Like, I'm gonna take very good care of my car. I'm going to, uh, like I was telling you, I don't know if I told y'all in my recent video, but I'm gonna give me a GLC 300 or a um, a Q8, a Q8 Audi truck, probably January. So I'm gonna have two cars. I'm gonna uh, pay this one cash, be through with it, and I'm gonna give me a truck. And I'm probably gonna give my mommy a new car. Which we, just, you know, it's God's plan. And I'm just ready, cause this is my year. So I'm gonna, you know, Everything I everything I say I manifest I do it like <coughs> mark my words just watch because I work so hard I deserve everything that I want and I'm gonna go get it period and it's just that on that but yeah so we're gonna get our car wash we're gonna pull up to Audi um oh and I was gonna go get a wax the eyebrow wax and the lip wax because y'all know Sarah didn't wax me last time because she was running late like she always do on her appointments. Turn left on so, Pope Street, then turn right onto Cedar Springs Road. Slow down, okay? Because if you run into the back of me, you gotta give me a new car. Okay, so, yeah, I'm about to pull up up here. Hey, it's not far from my house. It's super, pretty close. Um, I was gonna get coffee. This car beeps for everything. Like, I'm not even close to anything. I'm not gonna get coffee because they got coffee at the dealership, so I'll just get like some hot chocolate or something there, and it actually be good. So there's no point in me buying coffee when they have coffee. Does that make sense? I'm gonna I'm get into some things. Like, get what I say. I'm gonna get into some things in a minute, but not right now because I'm gonna pull up to the dealership and then I'm gonna have to stop talking. So I'm gonna get some, I'm gonna get into some things in a little bit. Not. Not, not 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 nothing too heavy not nothing too heavy but i just want to touch on some things you know what i'm saying um so that's what i'm gonna do but 
as far as everything else um this wig i want to let y'all know this wig is from because i know somebody gonna ask about my hair because it's so cute uh, i'll be doing my things i'll be doing my thing with these wigs but this wig is from unites hair this is a 24 inch body wave full lace wig i think it's 150 dense density i'm not sure i would have to check but um all the information gonna be in the link in description oh look at the puppy this hair is so pretty it's like thick all the way through and it's like shiny like i haven't even put nothing on his hair i sprayed it with water yesterday but that's about it but i really just woke up so this is like bad hair but it's super pretty like i love the waves um i love you nice hair i'm not gonna even lie like i said in my previous video like their hair never gives me any problems not saying that all the other brands do but i'm just saying like their hair is just I love when they send me wigs. They send me the best wigs. Like, and they're always like full, like I said. And they they like the um the wigs always fit my head. I don't have to cut off a lot of lace. I don't have to have a hard time. It doesn't take me that long to install their wigs because it's just like they're they're perfect. Perfect. <laughs> I love their wigs. Like, look how I did my baby hair. Look how look at this. Stop playing. Like, I always lay their wigs. Not saying that I don't lay my other wigs, but it's just something about you nice hair. They need to send me some 613 so I can have some fun. That's what they need to do because I really want, I really want to do a colored wig. I don't know if I want to do, um, like, a lavender or a really, really, like, royal blue or I have a pink wig. I don't want to do pink, but I do want to do, like, a royal blue or, like, a lavender so we'll see In but, quarter um, line, turn right onto king's road but yeah this wig um it's um i haven't i didn't glue it down with the ghost bond like i usually do like when i first started i just be gluing my wigs down with my uh bougie barbie hair gel and my uh free spray and they stay really good like they stay for about four turn days right onto king's road which is really good but yeah their hair is amazing like, I'm not gonna even lie to y'all. Like, if I didn't like the hair, I would tell y'all, like, that I didn't like the hair. Um, but yeah, and this girl, she actually went and bought the brown wig that I, that I, uh, that I, that I made a video on for, um, from You Nice Hair. She went and bought that brown wig. And I really want to see how she's looking at it because that wig is so pretty. That's my favorite wig. I'm not ever selling that wig because people be asking me, am I selling my wigs? No, I'm not selling none of my You Nice wigs ever. Like, this is some good hair. Like, so, is this the dealership? Oh, that took me around the back. Turn left. Girl! Where am I at? The dealership is up here. Why they got me going to the back? See, these GPSs ain't about nothing. Head. See, Turn. I, I kind of plugged it too much right here, but it's okay because... It's my head, not yours. <laughs> okay. So I ain't really tripping, but yeah, this is their body wave wig. Oh, the only thing about this wig that kind of, there's one thing that I was going to say. I was trying, while I was trying to part it in my video, it was like, I couldn't really part it all the way through. It was like, it the lace, the, I guess the front, the lace the front lace or whatever it doesn't it have like feet. a deep Turn part Street. so i couldn't really do my thug fizzle with um with the part because it only like went like literally right there i couldn't really part all the way back like i usually can with their wigs so i don't know if this is something new or what but yeah that's the only thing but that's not a big deal i ain't never been to this dealership i don't know what the head southwest we finna see, we finna see. Let's see, hold on, y'all. Cause I need my car wash. They got all these cars up here looking good. Head Northwest. Hush! I'm already here. I hate going to new places. I always go to the dealership in Grapevine. So I don't know too much about. Hold on, GT. Do I just pull up in here like last time? I think I do. But I don't know if I pull up behind. I'm gonna just pull up right here. Y'all, I honestly don't know. I just know I need my fucking car wash. Oops, sorry. Hi, 
Um, I need my car wash. Yeah. make me some coffee oh oh um, mama I guess I'm vlogging I've been people looking at me like why is she recording but, yeah. so I'm, I'm gonna go to um, I guess after this I'm gonna go to Vivian and then I need to I guess bring me your, the stuff for you. And I brought, are you still gonna crimp it? We come as, we come as a package. I was gonna wear my new jacket that I bought today, but I was like, my big pink one, cause it go on my outfit. But I was like, nah, let me, let me just wait. Not my makeup and stuff not done, but I'm, I'm dressed, like I look cute. <laughs> that sounded conceited. I look cute. That's funny. I was gonna reply, but you know me, I'm getting better at responding to negativity. Cause I just deleted it, but I wanted to reply so bad. Just delete it, just delete it, just delete it. Yeah. Cause you know me, I would have sit the long paragraph. I just said I'm gonna go over there after I leave here. You didn't listen to nothing I said. I'm gonna go to Vivian and then I think I'm gonna go get a wax real quick and then come to you. Or should I get a wax first, then go to Vivian, then come to you? Yeah, I'm gonna get a wax first because it shouldn't take them that long to wash my car. Okay. I'm about to post these promos. What month are you doing? Looking in the refrigerator? Ain't nothing in there. longer than expected <laughs> that's how caucasian people be they be like dragging but there's nothing wrong with it there's nothing wrong with it i love it okay so we gotta look ahead to sarah real quick i gotta hurry up i got stuff to do so no internet connection what is you saying what is you saying? Ugh. What? Come on. Okay. I don't have no lotion in my car. My hands are ashy because I just washed them. I'm about to apply Barbie Splash. This is a clear gloss with a 
peppermint scent. And I always OD with um, my clear gloss. Anyway, okay, we gotta hurry up. So I'm gonna get there by 11.46, okay. So. Now, let me get into some things. We finna get into some motherfucking things. All right, let's go. So, hold on. Okay. All right, so what I was wanting to talk about was, hold on, let me get on it straight away. So, hold on. That alley was weird, it's small. So, I just want to get into- the wrong way, I did. How huh? Head southeast toward- Turn left on my- Head northeast. I don't know if it's the right way or, or what. You know what, it looks weird. So, you know what, I'm gonna actually- <laughs> I don't know what to do right here, y'all. She probably gonna blow the horn at me. Ooh, this light is weird. All right, whatever. So, um, wait, I gotta concentrate first. Cause I'm loving this pink turtleneck. I got this sweater from Ross. Um, I think she was like $9.99. $9.99 for you. I think she was. Is it my go? Is my light gonna be green? Because. Okay, I'm confused. No turn on red. Oh. Y'all, this is weird. Okay, now I can go. So. Alright, so let me turn this down. I don't want to hear her because she's going to make me mad. So I'm going to have to turn her down when she get back on here. But, um, okay, so what I wanted to get into is basically like as far as support goes, as far as reposting goes and stuff like that. So somebody hit me up talking about, and it's not the first time. Somebody hit, somebody hit me up talking about post this, post this uh, for me. Somebody hit me up talking about post this, uh, you know, flyer for me, post this, you know, stuff for me. And I'm like, when I get messages like that, I automatically think, have you posted my stuff before? Have you supported my businesses? Have you supported my business in any type of way? You know what I'm saying? The cheapest thing on my website is $3.99, right? Let's just start there. If you're my friend, family member, anything of that sort, and you have not purchased anything from me, or you have not reposted my business or ever bought anything from me and you asked me to repost a flyer or you asked me to post um you know just whatever it is and you think that i'm gonna post it you're delusional you're delusional you know why because in order to get support you have to give support you know you have to be giving you have to, you know, it's like ever since I've gained, like, ever since I became, like, more of, like, I wouldn't say so much of a public figure, um, but it's like I'm really, like, a lot of people know me, so I've, I've become, like, very popular, you know, in the, um, you know, I've become very popular, basically, like, YouTube, my Instagrams, very popular. So a lot of people see that and they're like, okay, they have their businesses and they want me to basically shout them out or whatever the case may be. And I'm just like, no, because you've never done it for me. Now all of a sudden I got all these followers and I got all this, you know, and you want some clout. That's not how it works. If you want to support me from day one, it's, I'm, I'm not effing with you. Like I'm not, like it's just as simple as that. Like, <laughs> Like, it's just as simple as that. I remember this dude, I was out with my friends. He gonna say, give me a shout out. No. 
do I know you like that? No, you're not just gonna just drag you no shout out. Like y'all really be buggy. Y'all be buggy. <laughs> but it's just like, it's just crazy how like, uh, like well, this one, like one time this girl she inboxed me and she was like, can you um, can you post my flyer? <laughs> And I didn't even respond because no, I'm not reposting your flyer. You've never reposted my flyer. You've never reposted my business. You never told anybody about my business. Now all of a sudden you see that my page is really like growing. My brand is growing. Now you want me to post your brand on my page because you see, you know, I do numbers. And no, it's not going to work that way. I'm sorry. I don't apologize. I'm just not doing it. Like, I'm so tired of people trying to get over, you know? People legit be trying to get over. And I just don't like that. I just don't like that, you know? Because I've, I've, I grew, I grew my brand by myself. Like, my marketing is A1. Like, branding, everything is A1. I worked my butt off to get where I am today, you know what I'm saying? And I'll be damned if I just dry, just give somebody a shout out and they ain't even supported me, you know? No. You good. You good. You got it. You know? So, no. No, 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 no. I don't care who you are. No. You're not getting a shout out. You're not getting anything because you do not support me with my business. Period. And that's all I'm going to say on it. Now another thing i wanted to get into was tell me why i received like a really like hating comment you know what i'm saying on one of my videos which video was he it was my video with my car talk and my um i see you sport back but um what video was that on it was when i was in that patty mill right so somebody gonna leave a comment talking mess behind a fake page or whatever and it's just like people really be hating on me like people really be hating on me like why are you so mad because why are you so mad that i'm doing a damn thing out here like ain't that what i'm supposed to be doing do you want me to be on your level miserable and broke no like and then i was gonna reply but i was like you know what i'm i'm growing the category is growth category is growth i'm not about to respond with you because at the end of the day you typing but you're not even on my level in real life and I can guarantee you that because if a person wants to sit behind a computer and talk mess and talk about your life and be so mad about what you got then trust me they're not on your level they're not on your level I'm not gonna go back and forth with you because I already know what's up with me I already know what's up with me you know what I'm saying and that's why they really mad that's why people really be mad because you you doing all these good things. You got all this nice stuff. You got a, like, I got a nice place. I got a nice car. You know, my business is booming. And they hate to see that. They hate to see that. But yet they still watch me. They still watch everything I do. But you don't even like me. You don't like to see that I'm growing. You don't like to see that I'm just, I'm doing amazing in life right now. I'm happy. I'm blessed. At the end of the day, or if you're upset, you have to take that up with God. You know, God has put me in this position. And that's who you're going to have to take it up with. You're going to have to pray. You know, because all of that that you're saying, all of that, that animosity you have built up towards me, you're going to have to take that up with God. You know, that sounds very personal to me. Because at the end of the day, I'm not worried about what nobody got to say about me. You know why? Because like I said, I know what's up with me. I know I'm her. That's what I know. And I mean, and that's just that on it. And if you don't like that, if you don't like my attitude, if you don't like my confidence, guess what? Remove yourself because on this channel or just wherever you follow me, it's nothing but confidence. It's nothing but growth. It's nothing but winning. And if you don't like to see, if you don't like to see nobody winning, then you need to remove yourself. Because like I said the other day, like I said the other day, everything I'm doing right now, this is light work. This is light work. This car, that's light work. My place, that's light work. My business, that's light work. Give me, give me by the end of this year. 2020 is my year. I'm not playing. You really finna be seeing bigger and better things. All this stuff I'm doing now, like I said, this, this is light work. This is something light. 
So if you mad about this, if you mad about this little A5 coupe, if you mad about my business on the level it's on right now, if you mad about my place, you really about to be mad in a few. Like I'm, I'm so serious. Like you really finna be mad. This not nothing. This is light. So all that that y'all be mad about, like you might as well save that energy, boo. Save it for when, you know, cause things are about to get 10 times better. So save that energy for that. Cause this ain't nothing. This not nothing. I promise you this not nothing. So I just wanna, I just wanted to touch on that because I, I be seeing like some little hate comments and trying to throw shade and stuff. Trust me, you're not on my level. And I'm not talking to the people that's like, you know, that support me 100%. I'm talking to the people that, that be hating, that are fans. It's fan behavior. You don't like me, but you watch me and you talking stuff about me. And that's fan behavior. You're a fan. I'm not talking about my supporters. I'm talking about my fans, my haters. The people that still watch me but don't like me. That's fan behavior. Okay? That's fan behavior. You're a fan. So, are you going to let me over or are you just going to just, just keep filming? These people drive so bad out here. But yeah, I had to touch on that because, ooh, people be having me big. What are you doing? People be having me mean, you know what I'm saying? And I don't really be touching on situations like that because I already know what's up. Like I said, I already know what's up with me and you obviously already know what's up with me too. So that's why I don't really be responding to stuff like that because for what? That's a waste of time, that's a waste of my energy, a waste of breath, okay? So, bro, he about to piss me off. like a royal blue i love the color of my car it's so pretty it's like a royal blue which y'all you know i'm sure y'all have already seen um and the interior is the blue of the outside of my car so i'm like if i get my car wrapped pink the blue gonna throw me off because i'm ocd so if the pink if it's pink outside but blue and black in the inside they don't match to me so i'm like dang i can't do it so i gotta wait till i get my glc or my q8 and I'm gonna wrap one of those. So this car, I'm gonna just keep it blue. Somebody tell me I should wrap it in like a different color blue, like a uh, a pretty blue. I mean, my blue is pretty, but like a I don't know what color they said. It was it was some type of blue they said, but like a chameleon blue, something like that. But I don't know. I'm probably just gonna leave it how it is um, until I get my new car. I'm always talking about something new. One thing about me, I'm never satisfied. I like, I like to keep, I just like to just, I love, I don't know, like I just love to be in nice stuff. Like I'm very expensive. I'm very expensive. So these dudes gotta know, you gotta stay in your price range, boo. Before you try to talk to me, do you, am I in your price range? Baby boy. Because I'm expensive. I love expensive things. I love nice things. I keep myself up. So, you know what I'm saying? Always. So, I love nice things. I can't stress that enough. Um, But, yeah, like, that's just, I mean, that's just what it is. Like, I'm just living my best life. I'm only 22. Imagine me at 25. Like, stop playing with me. Y'all be so mad. Oh, it's annoying. Like, I don't really be trying to touch on stuff like this, but sometimes I be having to let y'all know. I, I done talking at your neck might just get your throat cut. Like Nikki said, stop playing with me. Just, just be quiet, mind your business, do you. Stay in your lane and stay in your price range. Stay in your tax bracket. Stay in your tax bracket, poo. Stay in your lane. I know it's lame or whatever, but just stay there. Okay? <laughs> Fuck. Anyways, that's enough about 
about that situation. Y'all, they get where I'm coming from. They get where I'm coming from. Um, I just hate when people create fake pages and talk stuff. Like, be real. Talk your stuff behind your real page. You know? Y'all be so pressed about me. Like, if you're not ready to be, let me just let me just say this before I before I exit this combo before we get to Sarah, because we're gonna pull up. If you're not ready to be talked about, criticized, um, all that, if you're not ready for that, then you're not ready to be like huge. You're not ready to be huge. You're not ready for your for whatever it is to take off. Because when like when your business take off, when your brand take off, you're going to be known. Like people are going to feel like they know you, know you. So you're gonna be known, and that comes with that comes with hate. That comes with rude people, rude comments, mean, nasty people. It comes with a lot. So you have to be ready for that. You have to be ready for people to be talking about you, spreading rumors about you. You have to be ready for that because it's going to come. Everybody's not going to like what you're doing. They're not going to love what you're doing like your supporters. They're not going to be here for it. They're not. So you have to make sure you're ready for that because if you're not, it will tear you down. It will break you down. I'm telling you, people are very rude and nasty and you have to be ready for that. You have to be ready for that. I have some tough skin, some thick skin. I really do because another reason I do is because like I've been through a lot. I've already been through a lot. So I've, I've gotten stronger and like I said, I already talked about how I've grown and stuff like that. And you just gotta learn how to ignore it. You gotta learn how to ignore it. I block and delete everything. I don't wanna hear it, I don't wanna see it, I don't care, don't come to me telling me nothing about, no, don't come to me telling me no negative stuff that somebody done told you about me that don't like me, I don't wanna hear that. At the end of the day, you fake for running back and telling me that. You see what I'm saying? Keep that type of negative, keep that type of stuff out of your life. Keep that negativity out of your life. Remain positive. Life is too short to be worried about what people are saying about you or what they comment commenting under your post and saying about you. Or about them disliking your videos or about the, you know what I'm saying? Life is too short to be worried about that. Just focus on you, focus on growing, focus on flourishing. That's what life is about. Life is about being happy. It's about growing. It's about just, you know, just um experiencing just being happy being open like don't let nobody make you feel no type of way especially if they don't know you personally don't ever take it personal people are gonna feel like they know you because they know you on social media because you have these all these followers and you have you know you you're in the public eye but people gonna feel like they know you and stuff like that don't let that tear you down don't let that break you down Okay, you gotta remain focused. You gotta remain positive. Okay? It's gonna all work out. It's gonna all work out. Cause I know a lot of people that be going through it, like a lot of celebrities and stuff, they like be on drugs and stuff and stuff like that. Because you know, they go through a lot. They go through a lot. Celebrities go through a lot. They go through, like I be reading some of their comments sometimes and people are just rude and nasty. Like people say some rude stuff. And I'm telling you, it comes with it comes with it. So you gotta be ready for it. Don't let don't let it change you. Don't let it don't let it change you. I just be like I said, block delete. Especially <laughs> I remember I seen a long paragraph of somebody talking this. I read the first sentence. I was like, oh, you're gonna be talking SHIT this whole time. So I'm just gonna delete and block. I'm not even about to read this whole paragraph. You literally wasted your time. You literally wasted your time for no reason. Now look at you. Comment is in the trash. <laughs> oh, I'm so funny. But, I mean, like I said, just be you. Okay? Don't let nobody, don't let nobody, um, change you don't let nobody make you feel like you're not worth anything because you definitely are worth everything okay we all are so that's it that's all i'm gonna say for now it's in this vlog i'm not i'm not gonna get too much into into i ain't gonna be dr phil 
I mean, thank y'all for listening to my TED talk. <laughs> but I'm gonna go in here and get this wax real quick. And I'm gonna pick up my strawberries. And then I'm gonna go see Mama Bougie. And then I feel like I got a lot of stuff to do today. <sighs> so we're gonna pull up. I'll be back. Good. Oh, what's that? Oh. <laughs> Hi, Hi, Happy Valentine's. Happy Valentine's. Oh, that's why you got heels on. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> don't tell me you don't even remember today. Happy mm. Valentine's Day. I really, I forgot. Really? Man, why you forgot, Bobby? Because I don't have a Valentine. Oh. You need to have one for next year, okay? Yeah, yeah. I need my lip too. Do I have a lot of hair? Yes, beauty. Yeah. Sarah, you text me for my nails. How? Show me. I don't you know. You put how. a lot. Oh. You charge me a lot. What? Who told you to do all them diamonds? All them diamonds? <laughs> you charge five dollars a finger, right? Mm-hmm. Only five dollars a week. A nail. Only five dollars each nail. This is my diamond. favorite nail. This one more than five, okay? How That's much this one was ten? Yeah. That's why I just charge even five dollars each nail. The diamond five dollar each nail? That's too much for you, Bobby. <laughs> and I make only two dollar fifty cent, okay? Two dollar fifty cent from them, but oh, you my own have? diamond. I had to pay for my own diamond. You see? I'm sorry. <sighs> oh, look at that! <laughs> oh, that hurts so bad. A lot like sticker and all kind of stuff. I didn't tell you do all that though. She just do what she want to do and then she give me a tab. <laughs> but you know, not your nail cool. Are, you know, your nail always uh, $100, right? Always. Yeah, oh, that looks better. Smooth. Mm, smooth. You can have smooth kiss tonight <laughs> for love day, <laughs> Valentine's day. I'm not kissing. Nobody? Okay, nope. wait until the last minute. Someone say, hey, baby, I want to come over. Whatever. <laughs> hey, Bobby, I want to come over, baby. Man, come to my I want to see you. Okay. I want to come over. Yeah. Are you oh. fine? Is it like, hey, uh -oh. I'm here. I okay. Do I need it? No. Okay. I hate getting my eyebrows sweet. Hmm? All right, how much is it? That's it, baby. Ooh, that hurts. Thanks, Sarah. Thank you. See you next time. Did you go out tonight? Okay. Thank you. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day to my queen. You and my mom are queen. 
queen. It's a you queen. 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 You don't know, nigga. You my queen. <laughs> and I wish a bitch or a bigger would. Oh, crap. <laughs> and I wish a could. $100,000 engine. This old lady holding her ears. Because it's cold. Breast specialist. Y'all do tit. Y'all do boobs. Oh, she is. You got a lot. It look like, hi. I'm going to say hi, friend. Yeah, you on the phone, speaker. It's okay. Hi, friend. Hi, friend. Thank you. You look like Thank you. Y'all let me know how they taste. I wish I got someone to Eckerheim, but I got y'all Okay, thank you. Thank you. Oh, they're so pretty. Are they? Yeah. Y'all bring me some. I'm gonna eat mine. Hold on, let me show my YouTube. She said she was with a patient. <laughs> oh. Oh my God. Uh, she said she threw some extra ones in here. Let me see. Hold on. Oh, look, you guys. My mom got me Valentine's Day treats. Oh my God. These are chocolate covered pineapples. And then these are chocolate covered strawberries. <gasps> <Ooh. laughs> I'm going to eat one real quick. You can see, you can see when I get there. Okay. But I'm gonna eat one of these. Bring him what? He got some? She got this box. Ooh. My mouth is watering. Mmm. 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 -hmm. <laughs> My mama got me this about times. Like, she loved me. Mm. I'm gonna come over there. <laughs> I'm gonna bring out some. Huh? All right.
somebody. You ain't got that many. No, nah, I'm taking the majority of yours. No, you're not. Mama, cause you didn't even want none. Yes, I did. Now all of a sudden, you want some. I got places to go, people to see, like, we need to drive. I need y'all to drive. What to say? Well, I didn't realize I sent that address. This is the picture I want. What? Okay, we're we gonna go to Mama Bougie house real quick. Put this little wig on. Man, them pineapples go so hard. They be better than the they be better than the strawberries. Yeah. They're so good. I keep two things. I'll be there in like 15. Okay. All right. Bye. So I had my Valentine's Day giveaway has ended today. I have a winner. Her her Instagram is so glossy. S O G L O S S I. She won the um, Valentine's Day kit giveaway. Um, a lot of y'all don't really pay attention to the rules to the um, yeah to the rules for the giveaway for the uh, giveaways that I have. You have to tag three friends underneath the post. Um, you have to repost the flyer on your page, not your story. I don't see stories really like that. You know how many DMs I get a day? So I don't keep up with stories. So when I tell y'all to repost the flyer and put the hashtag, I mean on your page, baby. Okay? Because there's no way I can go back and see stories. You see what I'm saying? Because stories go away in 24 hours. So no matter how many times you post on a story, I can't see that when it comes down to the day to pick you. You see what I'm saying? I mean, we're gonna have several more give giveaways. Y'all know I love doing giveaways because at the end of the day, y'all are the reason why I'm where I'm at today. So I don't mind doing giveaways. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna take care of y'all. But it's just, y'all have to follow the instructions in order to win. So you have to tag three friends underneath the post, underneath my post, follow my page, and um, I should have put follow my personal page and my business page too. But yeah, you have to follow my page and um, repost the flyer using hashtag Bougie Barbie B Day. So a lot of y'all did that, but a lot of y'all didn't. Yeah, a lot of y'all just did story posts. So I'm just letting y'all know when, when I do giveaways, never you can't post on your story. It's amazing you can post on your story, but you but it's better to post on your page so that way I can see it. You know what I'm saying? I want to see it. I don't really see stories that much, you know, because like I said, they go away in 24 hours and I get so many stories a day. Mm, I'm driving crazy. I'm sorry. So, I just want y'all to understand that. I'm gonna put mom's wig on. Ever since I learned how to do wigs, everybody want me to do their hair. I don't do hair. I do not do hair. Stop calling me to do your hair. I'm nice. I'll do my mama hair any day. But people hit me up. Can you do my hair? No. I don't do hair. That's what y'all don't realize. I just do my own hair. Because I do it the way I like it. The way I do my hair, you might not like it when I do it to you. You know what I'm saying? Here she go calling me again. What she want? Hello? Uh -huh. Girl, she said she gonna make she gonna make you some alcohol because you're so pretty. Aww. <laughs> she's like, she's like, I wish y'all could have got the alcohol, but I'm gonna make some just because she's so pretty. <laughs> Good, because I wonder what kind of alcohol she be using for them. She put them in those little tubes. She put any kind of like Patron. Ooh, Patron. <laughs> yeah, she infused them with these little tubes, and the tubes are sticking out. So you take a bite and then you squeeze it, you know. Um. Oh, that was so nice. I know she's like, y'all see where you look at you? 
this place. I know, right? Uh, uh, I remember I wanted to get uh, not all, not the all straight back, but I wanted to get like two. But I don't like when they be having like five going straight back. That's just like I don't, I don't know. I just don't like that. Oh, it's giving me sewing. Uh, I should have. <laughs> Oh, I don't know where my cap is. You know. Man, tell me why I get all the way to Sarah. Pull, I pull. I'm getting ready to leave, walking up to my car. They ain't put armor all on my ties. For real? Dummies. They lucky I didn't see that when I was up there. That's why I don't like going nowhere new. Well, you don't have to go to that one again. Yep. They don't know how to treat me. They don't know I'm a loyal Audi customer. Exactly. I'm not crazy over Teslas though, but they nice. Me either. I want they look funny to me. They look like a, a basic car till you look in the inside. Yeah. I want a Bentley. Give me a Bentley yeah. or a Rolls Royce. I see you in one of them. Yeah. Yes, I, I want a Bentley so bad. One day. Oh, you will get one. Oh, I know. So I'm guessing this top one is mine. Whatever you've been eating out of. Yeah. Well, I ate out of two boxes. That's the thing. Oh, wow. <laughs> Mama, relax. Because it's just the pineapple and the strawberry at the end of the day. At the end of the day, it's just the pineapple. It's just the fruit. <laughs> <laughs> But you shall turn them up. My stomach gonna be hurting. Am I smacking? Very. <laughs> That's that white chocolate. It make you smack delicious. <laughs> <laughs> hungry but i don't want to eat out nowhere i know you get tired of eating out so it's like what do i eat <laughs> um, why is it traffic what's what's time is it because y'all need to be at work it's 12 36 it's lunch time that's why mm -hmm. i'm always talking about somebody needs to be at work i'm not used to traffic I'm used to being at home at this time. Me and I'm third and I'm gonna just go home, but I think I wanna get something to eat, but I don't want, I don't know what to eat. Red Claw? I wish, but I'm not gonna drive over You wanna there. go? Oh. You driving, your car? Yeah. All right then, so hush. Cause you're doing too much talking. Right, you check your ass, can't catch. <laughs> you talking about your neck. <laughs> I hate the way you be laughing. <laughs> Why? My laugh ain't got nothing to do with you. I hope the tubes come while you're here so I can put them in your phone. They're probably already there. Uh-uh, I already looked outside unless they took them to the office. Stand up. Well, that song come on in the club. That she just reminded me of your mouth right checks. Can't cash. Can't cash. I wish bitch You walk around the club, ready to start some stuff. When well, that song come on, stand up. If you ain't rap, right, what you said? Then what do you say? Then book sway. What you see? Whoever made that song, they wrong for that. Because every time that song come on. It's T.I. It's somebody else. Stand up. They wrong for this. They got a whole bunch of people ass whoops on. <laughs> I love when that song come on in the club. I straight be slugging. <laughs> I, I don't think that song will ever get on. Somebody always get their ass whoops off that song. <laughs> What's that other fight song? Oh, that's funny. Uh, the girls. What's their name? Knock if you buck. Cry my Yeah. No, <laughs> 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 then when the girls come on, yeah, you walk to the 
Stop by really quick for Valentine's Day, but now I'm gonna go. So let me know how your hair comes out. Let me see. Let me take this. <sighs> probably come back, but ain't no use in me coming back over. Huh? 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 Mama, when I'm talking to you, get your damn foot off my wall. I was trying to put my shoe on. Respond when I'm talking to you. It's just a wall. And it's just the ass that's going to get kicked. <laughs> <laughs> Let me go. Let me make sure I get my shot I'm gonna take more pineapple than strawberry. Okay. Name the strawberry. Crap! I got a hole. I always got a hole in my tights, y'all. Are you on live? No, I'm recording for my YouTube. Don't put me on there. You was cute. No, Mama. No eyelashes in there. Mama. Don't be doing me. I don't have no eyelashes on. Even look at me. But, but you cute. Natural beauty. Yes, stomach. Where's my waist? <laughs> uh oh, inches. She said I know how to make a part. Oh, you do got inches. Let me see. Period. That's like how we do it. Wig flies off. <laughs> okay. So I'm gonna just. You should have brought me a clip. I want to go on a clip today. What did you bring a clip? Oh, let me get something. I don't want to read my eyes. Ooh, this a big. Chocolate ones? Give me a chocolate and white. I don't have any white ones left. Happy Valentine's Day. All right, see ya. Wouldn't wanna be ya. I can always guide you through, just call me. Okay. All right. I'm just watching your YouTube videos. <laughs> <laughs> you can do that too. Come lock this door. So, I'm gonna get back on here when I get home or if we go eat or something. So, I will see y'all in a few, okay? I love ya. Be there. So I just got back home. I bought my mom a gift for Valentine's Day. I actually ordered her something too, but it's not here yet. But I bought her these sandals because she sent me a picture of these the other day. She's like, I really like these. So I bought them for her today. This is how they look. They have these in um gold and white, and I'm gonna go back and get them. But I got these for her today. I didn't buy I didn't buy them today for me because I just bought me a different pair of shoes for tomorrow. So I'm gonna show y'all. It's my friend's birthday dinner, so I'm gonna wear these. These are super cute. 
Ain't these giving y'all Barbie vibes? Hold on. I'm gonna buy her a bottle of Hennessy for her birthday. But look, these are cute. And then I'm gonna wear it with this romper. Let's see if it go. I don't think I don't know if it's gonna go, but I think it is. I have a strong feeling it's gonna go. So this, I think it is. I got it from Fashion Nova. So this is the outfit. Perfecto! No, it's a little bit too light. It's a little bit lighter, but I'm gonna try it on to see. Cause look, y'all, we're gonna see if it blend though. In the camera, it look like it go for sure, for sure. So I'm gonna try it on, and then I'll come back and I'll show y'all. Okay. So this is the outfit in the Professional Nova and the shoes. I guess they'll go, excuse my legs, y'all, I'm ashy. I don't care. <laughs> but yeah, so this is the outfit. So this is the outfit. I'm wearing this to the dinner. We're going to Nick and Sam, just like a really expensive steakhouse. And you gotta be real cute, you know, cause I might need a sugar daddy. So I like this. And I'm not wearing this wig. I'm going to be wearing my 40 inch. I'm going to be wearing my 40 inch, my 40 inch wig tomorrow with this. And I'm gonna have it like slick back. And then I'm gonna have my bougie Barbie clips. And I'm gonna have on some pink lipstick. And it's gonna be a look. Okay. Yeah, sis, you look good. And these are comfortable too. These are super, ooh, let's see. These are super comfortable. This is the heel, it's like a silver heel. And then, of course I'm not gonna wear a bra, but I have my bra on from earlier. I just tucked it in. So yeah, it's a look. It's a look. I need a silver clutch. I was gonna wear rose gold heels and my rose gold purse, but I always wear my rose gold lace up heels, so I needed some new shoes to wear. So I'm wearing these. <laughs> so I'm just sitting here doing promo real quick. I want to find like a Thai restaurant to go to. I want some Thai food. Like, you know what I mean by Thai? Like some fried rice. Some fried rice for you. What's my business? Um, Leisure Clothing Co. Stop complaining about not having the Valentine's on Valentine's Day. It's people that don't have mothers on Mother's Day and fathers on Father's Day. Mm, I seen Super Post that and I couldn't, I, I looked at it totally different because that's facts. Like, we sit here complaining about not having a Valentine on Valentine's Day. But what about the people that don't have mothers on Mother's Day and people don't, don't and people that don't have fathers on Father's Day? You know, it's bigger than that. You know, so you got to think of it that way. So now I'm gonna go get me some, find me some tofu, like I said, because I'm hungry. I haven't ate all day. So I'll see y'all in a minute. And we're gonna end this vlog very soon. <laughs> so I just left the place, right? Get my fried rice that I've been wanting all day. And I thought my heater was on, that's the AC. So, I pull up, I go in, do all that, you know, blah, blah, and <laughs> I just look all jacked up. But anyway, so I order some chef rice, and then I order, do I turn right here? And then I ordered, um, because I wanted some egg rolls. So, I ordered, so I was like, I've never been here before, so... What kind of egg rolls or do y'all have egg rolls she's like no but we have these imperial egg rolls and they have like pork and shrimp you know she made it sound good 
So she brings my food. On I'm so glad I checked it before I left. She brings out the egg rolls and it stink. And then they wasn't even like breaded. Like, you know how egg rolls are like, they have like the breaded, like, you know, y'all you, know what I'm talking about. Don't even try to act like y'all know what I'm talking about. The breaded egg rolls. So I thought they was like breaded egg rolls or whatever. And they got these like white stuff wrapped around it and they stink. They were, they were funky. <laughs> so I was like, um, excuse me. I don't want these. I thought y'all had breaded egg rolls. She was like, no, they're not breaded. I should've went to Gloria's. That's where I should've went to get something to eat. I should've got, went and got me a chimichanga. Anyway, so I'm like, I don't want these, sorry. She's like, it's okay. And then I told her to bring me some sriracha. I opened the sriracha. I, I don't even open it first. I see that it's already not sriracha because it was orange. And sriracha is red so i smelled it and it was like a tangy i guess it's like a tangy hot sauce sriracha i don't know i've never been there before so i'm like y'all don't have regular sriracha she was like no i was like well i've never been here before so i did i i i'm, I'm so confused like i'm thinking this is just like a regular thai restaurant and y'all just totally jacked up so i'm just like take can you please take these off of my ticket i don't want these they stink sorry she's like I, i'll take them I wish I could have showed y'all, but I didn't even think to show y'all. But they were—they looked so gross and they smelled so bad. I don't want to eat nothing that stink. I'm not about to eat nothing that stink. But that rice, oh, slamming. I'm going to show y'all as soon as I pull up at the crib. I'm about to pull up right now. Got my phone. And look, this is every single day I come home. I knew it was here because they sent me emails. I mean, not emails, but pictures. <laughs> So this is the rice, looks yum. I'm gonna eat it with some chips <laughs> because I'm starving. And this is the end of today's video. I'm about to finish watching 13 Reasons Why and eat my food and probably take a nap because I'm tired. I'm, I just feel like taking a shower. I feel like eating, taking a shower and just chilling the rest of the day. So that's probably what I'm gonna do. I love y'all so much. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see y'all in the next one. Bye, bougie babes.